What's up, ladies and gentlemen, Ross the Boss coming at you with an all new Let's Play Saints Row the Third. We are now on part 31, about to finish Angel's next mission. Murder Brawl 31. Tonight's been a great night, and it's not slowing up, Bobby. An incredible night, Zach. And now, it's time for the main event. I can't wait. Let's do it. <laughs> there he is, Bobby. Eddie Kilbane Pryor, the walking apocalypse himself. You can't help but wonder how the Stillwater Butcher can't compete. I'll tell you, Zach, this psycho is a complete whack job. You know, when he came out of the womb, this guy literally choked out the doctor with his own umbilical cord. <laughs> that fucking sick. I'll be ringside, keeping luchadors off your ass while you finish Kilbane. Good luck, man. Well, there it is, Bobby. The Saints receiving no love here. Not at all. It is raining hate down where they are. And of course it is. After what their capo did to Stillwater, they're lucky the fans aren't knifing them on their way to the ring. Wait, oh my God, look at that. It's Angel de la Muerte. Angel de la Muerte, the second half of a pale riders, sometimes regarded as the herald of a walking apocalypse. The youngest wrestler to ever win the Super K Cup is here in the Steel Court Arena. History is writing itself tonight, Zach. After his questionable loss to Kilbane years ago, Angel dropped off the face of the earth. If you're a fan of Murder Brawl, this is shaping up to be the best night of your life. Let's get the crowd going. Defend All the right, ring. here we go. And here's the Butcher of Stillwater, Swagger and in. And speaking of surprises, here comes the Luchadors in force. <laughs> the Butcher that guy has a shirt. help from the fans. This has just turned into a lumberjack match from hell. All right, Bobby, you know, this is a classic matchup. Speed versus power, youth versus age, brains versus brawn. Well, you know, the fact that these two are tag team partners really adds Pick another layer to the whole Pick dimension. <laughs> they train together. They know this what really to expect. One wrong move can end the entire match, and you gotta wonder if Angel Ooh. is gonna be able to keep Taking his Taking everybody cool. out with one You know, swing. you're right, Bobby. The last time these two fought, Angel lost his mask to Kilbane, the greatest mark of shame in the Lucha Libre world. It's been years that had to be eating away at him. This is punishing to watch. The luchadors are manhandling him. This is sick. He's getting kicked around like a sack full of dead puppies. Oh, geez. Wait, the Butcher of Stillwater is making his way towards Angel. How much can one person be expected to... Oh, my God! A chainsaw! What the f***? Oh, my God! <laughs> what? He's got to be getting <laughs> slick on that floor. Hey, I got to get my grandma to so... get the mop. So over the top. On the Talk plan, about Bobby. They didn't account oh for the goodness. murder brawl chainsaw. It was a desperate move for a desperate time. But and I guess like you could say we are cutting off. right now through Now this is what people came here to see. Oh. The Butcher of Stillwater on an unstoppable rampage. Kilbane can't be happy to see this. I hope the audience brought some paper bags, Bobby. It is raining blood. Oh my goodness! Look at the blood fly! I could have had a V8! Look how far that spray went! Towel, please. You gonna make it, Angel? I think I broke my leg. Get in there and kick that bastard's ass. I can hold off these jobbers. Well, it looks like people are gonna see the fight they paid for as the Butcher of Stillwater stands toe-to-toe -to -toe with Kilbane. Now, this is classic Saints tactics. Use someone to weaken up the opponent then swoop on in for the kill. I love it. Into the ring. Ah, oh, here we go. We have to run to the other side. I already beat your champion. Now, kneel before the walking apocalypse! I'm not leaving here without your fucking mask. When I'm through with you, you'll be begging for me to tell you! Oh, man. You. This is gonna hurt. This ah. is it, folks. Two giants in the field of destruction facing off for our entertainment. Does it get any better than this? No, An it doesn't. So only one of these two has the good sense to leave the violence in the ring. Let's all remember the charge again. He dodged it. Here comes the reversal. Look at the brutality from the butcher. 
I think you'd have to be naive Jump to believe Kilbane. a giant like Kilbane w hasn't thrown in a few punches here and there outside the ropes, Bobby. Not like the punches being thrown in here tonight, Zach. Both of our contenders seem to be out for blood. Kilbane isn't bowing down to the butcher anytime soon. But this celebrity of the streets isn't making it easy on Kilbane. There seems to be something more going on than two world-renowned titans wishing to settle who rules the mountaintop. Oh my god! And Kilbane goes sailing out of the ring! Fight Kilbane. Do I wait till but he gets wait. in the ring? He's already heading there we back go. in. Looks like the Stillwater Butcher isn't oh. getting a moment's rest tonight. That's right, Zach. There are no free rides against the walking apocalypse. <laughs> you betcha. No matter who wins tonight, someone is going home with crushed dreams and internal bleeding. The crowd right, can't get enough of the cards, and quite frankly, doll. Zach, neither can I. Oh, yeah. Can he land the kill switch? Another miss from Kilbane. The champion cannot be happy with that one, Zach. Jump on Kilbane once again. Let's move him into a steered direction into the corner. That sound will stick oh. with you. Go, Rose. There he goes. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh. All's fair in love and murder brawl. Kilbane's knocked out again. And here come the luchadors in his place. Murder Brawl is certainly giving the finest and blood-gushing, bone-mashing entertainment tonight, Bobby. My heart goes out for the cleanup crew on this one, Zach. I will certainly take this shark. Give it up while you can still walk. You won't even realize how... There he goes. Oh, and I think we can finish him Another third time to charge. This is incredible. The Killbane just can't connect. We're gonna with have the to jump switch. on Killbane, bring him into the corner here. can get right there, Bobby. Oh, you better believe it. Ready for your close-up? Wait. I'll give you the secret of the Apocryphist. Just leave me my mask. All right, do we Apocryphist weapon or Killbane's mask? I would really like Killbane's mask. Smile, Killbane. We're going nationwide. No! Shades of Angel de Arte as Kilbane has been demonized. Yes, we have seen the face of the walking apocalypse. And to be honest, it's a man with a receding hairline. <laughs> a man with a receding hairline. They gotta love it. Against all odds, the Saints are still standing. What a night, Zach. What a night. Kilbane, it's just a match. It's my fucking reputation. This is my city. I am its Caesar. Oh. And I get to fiddle while it burns. Looks like we've completed a murder brawl 31. We are going to be getting $16,000 in cash plus a 10% bonus. And of course, we are now rank 33. And we now have Killbane's mask to wear. And we have $67,000, so let's go ahead and we're going to head back to our Saints Row um, headquarters here. Let's pull up a vehicle delivery, the X2 Phantom. How far away is it before I do anything? 
Uh, it is quite far. And of course, it is in stag territory. So, a little unfortunate. No one who was in attendance will ever forget the incredible spectacle that was Murder Brawl 31. The capacity crowd anticipating a grudge match between Eddie Kilbane Pryor and the Butcher of Stillwater was first shocked and delighted by the stunning return of Kilbane's former tag team partner, <laughs> Ángel de la Muerte. In the end, it was the Butcher of Stillwater who stole the show by dealing Kilbane a crushing and humiliating defeat. This may have been the final page of Kilbane's storied career, but with the return of Ankel and emergence of the Butcher, Murder Brawl fans are too excited to care. This is Jane Valderrama. And it looks like we still haven't completed this mayhem uh, mission, so let's go ahead and we'll do that as well. Cause widespread carnage with the weapons provided. Oh! The Saints rule everywhere! Uh, I wish I didn't destroy my bike, but that's all good. For some reason, taking out trash cans and mailboxes do some the most amount of uh, damage. And of course, we get the most amount of money. That works! We have a 40 person combo. This is so much 45. more relaxing than painting. Oh, woo. That would make Gat proud. We are almost always halfway there. Counts. more relaxing than painting. I wish we had a group of cars coming at once, but I guess for the time being, we are still going to be roaming around. We have 107,000, making our way to 200. <laughs> nice. I love meeting new people. Wow. And we only need about 10% more. No, not even that. Maybe about 3%. Oh. And now we are over the limit, getting our $200,000 total. And we have completed our mayhem mission. And I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. As always, thank you for joining me, and I'll see you in the next episode.